everybody, welcome to this amazing game of Mortal Kombat 11. Today, we're just going to play some online matches as Collector. Uh, so, if you need to know what my setup is, I'm playing on a PS4 controller, but the Steam customization thing, for some reason, detects that it's an Xbox controller. So, it says the Xbox inputs, like B for quit and stuff. Don't know why. Just does. So, Mortal Kombat's a great game. If you've never played it before, it's... A fighting game. If you're not into fighting games, it might not be your style of game, but it's pretty fun. And if you if you don't play it because you're scared of how good you get or anything like that, there's nothing to be afraid of. The game no nobody starts out amazingly good. And the, the inputs can be a little difficult, and you know um, could be hard to understand. There's a lot of mechanics in this game, but the best thing is you always get better. If you notice my win loss ratio pretty freaking on the losing side here reason for that is because when i find someone i lose against i play against them and lose several times to learn how to combat that kind of um, that kind of style of play um sub-zero is one of those people i lose to all the time so i always rematch a sub-zero but we're gonna do three best to threes in a row so even though if this sub-zero is so good i would like to keep fighting him i'm gonna stop after the best of three rule so he's got he's got a scary set of moves on he's not playing like normal ones that's for sure oh god he's different than the other ones i'm aware of Dude, he's full on aggression. Holy shit. Yeah, that's what I like to play against. He's mixing up. Damn. Overhead to under, over to under. This dude does not lay off. Oh, that was my bad. I should not have jumped. I tried to jump the slide and kick it. Let's try to... Oh, jeez. Oof. His low jab from that is ridiculous. No low jab for you, dude. You get in the corner this time. Let's see what you do. He's, he's got just as good as anyone else. Gotta be careful. Oh, boy. I think he's got me. Yep, that's it. God. That's that's what I lose to. Um, my weaknesses are Sub-Zero, Noob Saibot, Scorpion, and Liu Kang. They are f a four set of characters with just the most ridiculous pressure that I've seen in the game. Having the easiest over to under attacks. So, if you don't understand Mortal Kombat and how it works is, you have a block button. You can block high or low. Lows block everything in the middle and low and highs block everything mid to high um and there's overheads which high blocks as well so you this guy here has a lot of these moves that are really annoying like that yeah that would be it we should have a Oh, he amplified that for a faster run. Shit. He amplified that move. So amplification takes your meter at the bottom. Oh my gosh. Woof. He's just in. I can't I can't stop him. This is bad. I think this will be it. I'm gonna jump Oof. Except he jumped towards me and got a decent combo. I just gotta keep him out. Gotta keep him back. Ooh. Okay, so we're gonna wake up one more time. Oof, into the overhead. Ah, oh, can't do anything. So we're not gonna do any- Ooh, never mind. That was a bad idea. Oh, 
Oof. Chit me to death. So even if you block, you do take a little bit of damage. Sub-Zero is rough. So we lost our first. First to three. Because he got two. Damn. I have to learn to fight that kind of pressure. This is the type of person I would constantly fight against until I got used to that kind of uh, pressure. Unfortunately, I, I can't do anything against it. It's it's rough because it puts you in such a state that you're not getting anywhere. Um, he's got an instant travel across the screen, which is a slide, which is hard to read. You just have to predict it's coming. Is that the same guy? I hope it's not the same guy. I guess we'll let this be. This. If it's the same thing, we'll always accept the match again and go for it. That'll be the rules. I like setting up pools. Oh, it's a scorpion. It seems like the ninjas are obviously the most popular, and it's a terrifying aspect. So he's also got another teleport that is rough. And unlike Sub Zero's, it's not an instant across the screen. He instead teleports behind you. So it's great for getting behind your projectiles. So he's likely gonna do it there, and we're gonna punish. See, these teleports do have problems with them. For example, they... Oh, shit. Alright, I hope he teleports. See, when you block something like that, there's a punishment to it. Like, you get a free full combo uncontested. Or you could just run into that. Yeah, he keeps going for it, and that's that's doing him bad. Unlike the Sub Zero, this guy's not pressuring me properly. Not like normal scorpions. So we're gonna take this easy. Just approach carefully. Oof, that's an overhead to low. That's an overhead, and we'll just go ahead and grab and punish. You, the biggest thing about Mortal Kombat is learning what to punish. Overhead to low. Ooh, I pressed a button. We'll push him back. Push him back one more time. He jumps again. Oof! Into that low. There we go. Alright, we're gonna check his knees a little bit there. Woo! And so, that's a breakaway. I'm not gonna get hit in a full combo for that. Ooh, and that's the fatal blow. Fatal blows are when you're at that final portion of your health that's indicated at your health bar. Um, you get to do this massive damage attack. Ah, I think I, no, I should, no, I don't know. I don't know why I didn't block that. Maybe I did, I was too low of health to take that. Okay, what's he gonna do? What's he gonna do? I'm gonna check your face, there you go. Have some flames. Ooh. I'm pressing buttons. Oh, I got punished super hard for pressing that button. Stop pressing buttons. That's what you get for pressing buttons. Have some fire. Oh, shit. That's it. Oh, why do I press buttons? Don't press buttons. He's... He likes to. He likes to. I'm gonna... I'm... I also like to press... Take that. I need him to press a button that he doesn't. Lead check. Knee check. Knee check. Knee check. Knee check. Ooh, that was a low. Eh, yeah, take it. I like fire, don't you? Boom. Oh! Oh, shit. So you're probably asking, why are we not doing fatalities? And one, I might have to cut out fatalities for YouTube demonetization. Um, we might do some unique YouTube videos for Patreon only in the future. Uh, but for now, if, we, if fatality happens, I got to cut it out. Oh, snaps. He quit. Was that the first? It was the first game. Well, darn. That was Ooh, I have not played a Devora online yet. This is new. She's a bug lady. She does nasty bug things. She is actually very disgusting. Um, 
So I I don't know how she works. So we're gonna learn <laughs> together. This is gonna be an experience. Hopefully they don't skip the intro. They're pretty funny. I'm covering some of the subtitles. Sorry. Have you seen Ferrator? Only their corpses, Collector. Shao Kahn will not be pleased. Ah, uh, that wasn't as good as I thought it'd be. Better. Whoop. Nobody expects that. Alright, got her on fire. Ooh! See, that's... Man, what the fuck is that? Oh, good. She fell right for it. I messed up my own combo. Gotta stop pressing buttons, honey. Oof, God. Oh, that's an overhead. Oh, that's an under. You are gross, lady. Oh, God. Oh, what? 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 Fucking hell. Madam, calm down. Holy shit. It's confusing when she can do all this. That's okay. I think I'm just gonna anti air into. I don't know. What? Leg checks! Leg check! Leg check! Leg check! Oh, that instant overhead, though. That's a huge range for that shit, too. She went for the fatal blow. Get out of here with that shit. We'll go for the grab. So she's got a slow startup apparently for that stuff, but I'm gonna take that win. Oh, yeah, there you go. <laughs> Ooh, she's scary, dude. I can't, I can't do that. I do love his finish though. He puts them in the bag. And I like the cosmetics. You can get so many different kinds of bags. I got this one. It's one of my favorites right now. A lot of people talk about the grind of this game. Ooh, microtransactions. Not as true as everyone may make you think it is, if you've heard of it. I didn't even hear of it until... Alright, we're gonna just rush in. Oh, rushing was a bad idea. Woo. Grab. Oh, no grab! Oh god, we're both so ranged. Oh man, that missed. That's not good. That's not good. That was my only anti-pressure. She's gonna she's gonna want to jump for it. I don't know why that bull is not coming out. Done in. She got me good. She's she's playing the range game. And that's terrifying for me. God, it all hits from so far. I can't. I can't do anything. I can't even check her legs. I don't know what's an overhead. Man, she's good. Fuck off, lady. Oh, it was just out of range. Thank you for not fatality. Normally you don't fatality until you leave, but I might leave them in if they happen. But I, can't, I really don't want to be demonetized from Mortal Kombat's dumb violence. I hate, I hate how unrealistic the violence is, and they're like, demonetization thing. So she's going to come in, so I'm going to just hit her hard with that. Teach her a good lesson of... 
Got her. There we go. Yeah, she's still trying that shit. I'm not letting her. Nope, not letting you. Yeah, no, you're dead. Almost perfect. We're gonna back up and then re get in there. Oh, never mind. That was a mistake. I didn't think it was gonna hit the way it did. I just back up. I just back up every time. Oh, I went back into it for some reason. I can do that too. Come on. What's your life? Get her in the corner. Got it. Woo! All right, so we beat the Scorpion. We beat the Devora. We lost to the Sub-Zero. Not a bad day. Maybe a bad show off at the beginning, but we learned things. So if you're curious to what these things are, I'm in the way of one of them. Can you see it's a heart? You get little currencies and they're to unlock certain things and, um, get you all set up for the crypt and I could show that off at a later date if you want it let me know in the comments um, but this game has a lot to it you've got the main story mode sorry main story mode towers of time which is like very very difficult challenges that you can put equipment on for to make yourself better and to combat the the challenges like they'll have like poison where you're taking damage all the time so you have to bring something to avoid the damage or something of the sort they have classic towers which is just standard combat they have the crypt which is pretty cool uh this is where you do your loot boxes a lot of people very upset that your your rewards are randomized but none of it is paid for with real money it's all earned in game through that gold currency over there sorry my hand cuts off right there but uh that my other currency right there, the blue one there is a store uh, for example here you can buy like outright skins with for free i mean like i earned the money they're pretty cheap 500 got 750 right now i've been playing for what like three days um and then they have their actual this is like you have to buy this with um real cash i think right like that's yeah it requires the real cash i don't even know how much it doesn't even say that sucks but yeah no that's that that's that. I play on PC. If you guys want to play against me, let me know in the comments down below. Add me on, uh, well, don't don't add me because I, I have so many friends. I'll stop by my stream. That way I can get you in and know who you are and we can play live. Um, if you want to get into this game, it's got an intensive tutorial that also rewards you for completing it. You get, you get like an announcer voice. You get all these tutorials and then a tutorial for every character to just teach you the basics. I finished everything. Took like three hours. Ridiculous. They even have fatality training if you want to get your fatalities down. And basic tr uh, training to just teach yourself. Along with the customizations on your characters, you can actually customize your own moveset, which I thought was really cool. Um, and for example, you can customize individual pieces to them. So like my, my Scorpion, I have a couple of his different swords. So that's actually really cool. It's small details, but I mean, they still, you could still see him. You could even like change his little spear that he shoots out. So you can have the basic spear and then the Hanzo spear, all these different kinds. And you could really see them, even though it's small detail, but that's not the only thing. You do get full on costumes you can change to. Uh, some, mo some of them are reskins, some of them are just recolors. They've got a good assortment. They tell you where to find them. So these are rewards from the Towers in Time. Um, if it says Crypt, then Crypt is the uh, the random loot boxes. But again, reward an AI battle. Ooh. See, not everything is grindy. You can, you can find where to get your things. You can customize your intros. You can customize your fatalities, brutalities. This is just 
so much in this game. It is lovely. Is it a slog to grind all this? I don't know. I haven't been paying attention to that. I've been having too much fun actually just playing the game, and I just take my money once in a while and just go open stuff up and see what I get. It's, it's addictively fun, and that's pretty cool. So that's all I've got for you guys today. Thank you all for watching. If you like what you see here, please give me a like, comment, subscribe. Don't forget, this came on early for Patreon. Thank you, Patreons, for your beloved patronage. I couldn't have done this without you. Shout out to all of you there. Show some credits. All right. Thank you guys so much once again. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. And as always, good game.